I don't know melee stuff either. Oh, are you coming back? Okay. Yay! I have I have somebody with melee. So, how about this matchup? Uh, Falcon wins. Okay. Falcon wins. I I think people argue a lot as to to what extent Falcon wins, but everyone agrees Falcon wins. So like Johnny and I think Hugs think you know Falcon has a slight advantage. Right. Duck until pretty recently thought the matchup was unwinnable for for Samus to the point where he would go secondaries. He uh, there are at least two sets on YouTube of Duck going Marth against Wizard to not a whole lot of success. Because yeah. if you don't know what you're doing in the Marth Falcon matchup, you will get bodied. Right. Like. Like even yeah, like, like even top Marth mains like, a lot of them hate the Falcon matchup because of how good pun Falcon's punish game is and, like, I mean I think Marth bodies Falcon if you know what you're doing, but it's because of all these little tricks he has like hurt box manipulation, tech chasing, like reaction tech chasing. Um, but although I feel like yeah, Samus has a little bit of play here with the jet box. Like, Sort of space. Not nope. Really. Falcon doesn't care. If, uh, if Falcon's playing right, he's just going to narrow up there for all the projectiles. Oh, okay. That was such a win. That's a big part of why Samus' projectiles don't matter a lot against Marth either. Oh, okay. Uh, Marth will just swat him. Yeah. Uh, but Falcon has... Like, Falcon's big strength in the matchup is his dash dance. Samus' approach... I mean, it's, it's bad. Samus has a bad approach. That charge. And so when Falcon's dash dancing, Samus' only option is to... I mean, she can shoot projectiles, which are easily aerial, or she can slowly encroach on space, which is slow and pretty much requires you to soft read them multiple times in a row. And that's really hard. And Falcon just has to read you, like, encroaching space, like, once, and he just runs up and grabs you. And then you have to deal with getting juggled with others. Sure. So... Jerry definitely seems to be handling himself, though, really well with the edge guard. Like, two times here, he's had really solid edge guards, which either have killed or really wrecked. Ooh, nice knee, reverse knee by Elements. It's two socks to one, Chevy's favor. If Elements can abuse the matchup really well here, he could be he could take the game. Um, nice missiles by Chevy to try to wall out Elements because. But I see what you're saying. He can just sort of go through. He can, but any aerial and get right to it. Exactly. Unfortunately, Elements is, I think, a little bit scared to challenge them. Right. I mean, that's why Chevy is spamming missiles as much as he is. I mean, understandably. It's hard. Um, you gotta time it right, right? And if you don't time it right, you're you can get yeah, bodied if you don't time it right. So. What is Chevy, Chevy oh, is okay. winning apparently. All right, one over Chevy. Chevy will probably ban the final destination, so I'm gonna guess elements will go to the stadium. Um, I could potentially see Dreamland as well, given that he did that against the Puff, and it's Why a not FOD? Um, because Falcon's main strength in the matchup is the fact that he can run away, and found Fountain is small. Uh, also, Fountain of Dreams is like really Although awkward for is... aerials. <laughs> oh snap! The reads. One more quick question about Sadie. Um, is PS1 as good for Samus as PS2? Oh, no. no. Interesting. Uh, yeah, okay. So, so, the transformations are bad for a lot of characters, but like, you do gotta keep in mind that the transformations are a small fraction of the time compared to the main picture stage. Right. And so, I think, I think overall, Chevy and other Samus players like Stadium a lot. Sure. Uh, a lot of Marth mains and Falco mains love Stadium as well, um, and a lot of Falcon mains love Stadium. I would say those five characters tend to be the most. Well, um, I don't know. Pretty much anyone that has like a good dash dance tends to like it there. Because like Pikachu right. likes Stadium a lot. I mean, everyone hates it once it becomes rock transformation and you're, you know, have to deal with the fox with a wall behind you. But as far as neutral transformation goes, it's it's FD with platforms. That's a pretty neutral stage. Um, it's bad for like Sheik and Peach, but it's good for a lot of folks. How do tethers yes. work this, um, for some in this game? Are they similar to any type of tether? They are completely different from PM tethers. So the way tether works, I you would probably be able to explain the full mechanics better than I would. 
<laughs> Sorry, I'm new here, guys. No, it's fine. I mean, I don't know everything about the mechanic, but uh, when you use a tether in this game, it shoots out until it hits stage collision. And then once it locks onto stage collision, uh, characters go into like a tethered position, which is where they will swing until they're uh, just kind of hanging. Right. Or I guess that would be hanging position. I can't even remember. Uh, then you press, I believe it's A or any attack button, and you'll reel in. Okay. And then <clears throat> you have grab boxes at certain points during your reel in animation. Yes. And ooh, oh. he's got to get back to that bomb. Mm. Oh, Teddy. Yeah. That was, that was interesting. Um, but yeah, it, it reels in um, from the anchoring point of the tether. So, whereas in PM, which of course we'll be getting to later, uh, PM automatically searches for a ledge and then snaps to the ledge and yada yada does that. Um, so explain the grab to me. Is that used at all? Useful at all? The, the Like while you're coming back up, you were saying you have a grab? Uh, no, you got a ledge grab box. Sorry, oh, that's that's okay. what I was talking about. Uh, yeah. There is there is a hit box on its way out with tethers from time to time. Um, that's not that. A oh, he's dead. Uh, oh, he's actually left. It's not. Yeah, it's yeah. Um, you can you can see it do stuff in teams. There are some really really crazy like montages of Samus saving their teammate by like tagging them and then jumping up and doing oh, wow. yada yada all this crazy stuff. But yeah, it's it's pretty cool. Yeah, elements might take this one. Here you go, back to it. Back to it. Oh, snap. Oh, oh, he wanted it! He wanted it! He got too greedy! He got too greedy because yeah. he saw he the W greedy. but messed up. Oh, that was tragic, but good, good stuff to elements and good games. Chevy takes a 2 0. Chevy being a really freaking good player. Yeah. <laughs>